Adrian Hauser. Yeah, he was outstanding his last time out. That was against the Rays. Six innings, four hits, no runs. 84 pitches to get through six innings for Adrian. Mauricio Dubon back in the leadoff spot. And Dubon takes a strike. Backdoor sinker. Breckman flies to right. Fairly deep, but Anderson is there for out number two. And Alvarez draws the walk. That has been a familiar theme. The Brewers clearly pitching around Alvarez, as do most pitching staffs. And Tucker on the first pitch, a little flare in the left field, a base hit. Once again, Dusty Baker with the two lefties hitting back to back in his order. That brings up Jose Abreu. You figure at some point Abreu is going to get hot. One ball, one strike on Abreu. Two men aboard here, and Beats one into the ground. You got plenty of time. Adamas makes a play, and that's a good start for Adrian Hauser. Today, Brandon Belak makes his fourth start of the season, his fifth appearance overall, and here's what he's done so far. Yeah, he started out very well. That's a great game the last time. You're going to see a lot of sinkers and change-ups with him. Christian Yelich will lead things off for the crew. And Yelich slaps Allen down the left field line. It is slicing. It is down. A base hit. McCormick cuts it off. The speedy Yelich into second base with a leadoff double. Here's Willie Adamas, who narrowly missed a couple of home runs last night. Towering fly ball out. And he sends Allen deep to center field. Adamas watching this one fly out of here. A two run blast. The Brewers strike early this afternoon. Two run home run in the first inning for Adamas, number nine. As you were talking about, a couple of near misses yesterday, able to get all that one. A two spot quickly for Milwaukee. First two batters of the game for the Brewers offensively. And Telez, a swing and a miss, another changeup. Miller, the center field. Back on it is Myers. He'll track this one down. Two and two to Contreras. Very good. Checks his swing. No, he didn't. He goes too far, says first base umpire Shane Livensparger. And Belak picks up his second strike out of the inning. Belak retires three in a row after the two run home run, but Willie Adamas puts the Brewers in front 2 0. Going back to that 19 season, Framber Valdez of the Astros and Logan Webb of the Giants, the only two pitchers with a better ground ball percentage than Hauser. That's a little soft one out to Adamas. He makes the catch. A little humpback liner off the bat of Jeremy Pena, and Adamas able to flag that one down. There's a ground ball. Adamas another chance. He's going to be busy today. Skips one across. Picked by Telez. Nice play on both ends. And the speedy Chaz McCormick is cut down. Two gone. First ball swinging. Jake Myers rolls one to Terang. That is an Adrian Hauser classic inning right there. Seven pitches. You guys were talking about the ground ball percentage for him on the sinker. That's always such a, a key stat to keep an eye on with him. Grounds one to third. Miller's got time across the diamond it goes and the ground balls are coming quick for Adrian Hauser just what you want to see chopper to third got to hustle it over to first Miller does and two outs both on ground outs to third base going up there again Bregman skies one to center field so Hauser sticking with the game plan he's throwing it where he wants to He's got another three up three down inning seven in a row retired Brandon Belak back to work after a quick inning Leg kick the pitch ground ball left side of the infield tough hop and Bregman handles it well and he throws out Weimer Belak sends this one the other way one hopper speared by Bregman that is a fine defensive play by the Astro third baseman and it's a broken bat slow roller to the third baseman Bregman half of the bat rolls by him. He feels it and he throws out Adamas. So another one, two, three inning on three ground outs. Two nothing, Brew Crew. They lead it as we go to the fourth inning. Oh, on a line drive hit the center off the end of the bat. Here comes Weimer and he makes the catch in high. Nice play made by Joey Weimer. Tough one to judge right at you, right off the end of the bat from Jordan Alvarez. Nice catch. Tucker grounds one to the right side. Gloved on one hop by Teles. He feeds Hauser covering the bag. Two quick outs in this fourth inning. A little flare out to Terang, no problem. Hauser keeps mowing him down. Ten in a row, he's retired. And line drive to center by Rowdy Telez gets his spot <clears> in the fourth <throat> inning going. Going Miller's at the plate, and ground ball hit to short. They could get two out of this. There's one and a double play. 
The one pitch popped up. Will Breggy get there? Long run. Yes, he will. Foul territory. Nice running play by Alex Bregman to end the inning. But both pitchers have settled in nicely now. Hauser is dealing. Four shutout innings, putting together some pretty awkward swings. Hauser pounces on this one, makes the throw in time to get Pena. A swing and a miss. He got him. Power sinker. McCormick right over the top of it. That's a called strike three. Hauser with the comeback sinker. Back to back K's. He has retired 13 straight. Wednesday afternoon affair. Nice crowd on hand. They've seen a good game. It's clipping along here. High fastball. Nice play to Les. Knocks it down. Got a hurry. And safe. You're getting into the lumber company with the Astros. These are the dangerous hitters coming up now. This ball hit pretty well to left, going back on a Yelich, and it's over his head and off the wall. Dubon will head to third, Bregman to second. Astros with runners on second and third, and one out. So Hauser's done. Excellent outing for Adrian Hauser as he goes five and a third. Craig Council has made goes. a call, but there is some confusion, and it will be pie up. Big spot, second and third, one away. Alvarez, a mighty swing. The pitch, and it's in there. Pyops. Rings the bell with a breaking ball. Nasty slider. Freezes Alvarez. Out number two. Hauser watching. Piamps trying to get through it. Tucker in the air to center field. Weimer on the run. He's there. And the inning is over. Tucker hit a liner right at Joey Weimer. Owen Miller really off to a good start this year. Now he's having a great month of May. Owen Miller in the center field hits it well on the run goes Myers and he's looking up goodbye Owen Miller does it again back to back games with home runs number four and it's three to nothing Brewers uh, what a two strike approach that he's been able to put on the baseball so far this year Brian Anderson at the plate Anderson today ground out and a strikeout. Anderson drives one to right field. That ball's well hit. Tucker looks up, and that one's gone. Off the coffee pot. Brian Anderson. Coffee's for closers. A solo shot, and it's 4 nothing Brewers. Brian Anderson, his eighth home run of the season. This will be a test for Hobie Milner as he gets Alvarez and Kyle Tucker. Alvarez into center field. Weimer is there, and Milner there falling go. behind in the count puts him away. Yeah, high fastball got him down on the trademark. Tucker bouncing ball to Telez. And Milner is right there for him. Two gone in the ninth inning. Milner fires in there. Called strike three, and the ball game is over. The Brewers win. They get another shutout. Their second set of back-to-back -back shutouts this year. Number six on the season.